So today is Sunday, the, what's the date today, babe? 13th. 13th, I have a bunch of spots on my camera lens. Oh, that just made it foggy. Because I always forget to close it. Darn it. Oh, that looks much better. So you see the mess that my son has made over there. That's baby Asher. Say hi, baby Asher. Hi, baby. Hi, baby. Are you mommy? Yes, I am mommy. Say hi, Amos. Hi, Amos. <laughs> hi. Hi. Hi, I Okay, go play with your toys. Mommy, you gonna do something. So I just wanted to do a brief vlog on um, day, I don't even know, I had my surgery on the 4th and today is, what's the date today babe? The 13th. The 13th. So I've had my surgery for a little over a week. I forgot to mention to everybody, um, okay hang on, mommy say hi in a second okay? I forgot to mention everyone that um, after breast surgery you like retain a lot of fluid like right now I look kind of swollen in my past vlogs I've looked swollen and I totally forgot to mention that um, it usually happens about a day or two after your surgery and you could even google it like it happens to just about anyone I'm not sure if it's just breast surgery or if it's any kind of surgery like last night I was seriously looking at my stomach and I was like oh my god I look like I'm six months pregnant like right now I can show you if my husband would hold the camera for me for a second just like that oh here's like a fluffy shirt whatever but this is what I look like side and that is not normally what I look like side I look don't I look pregnant? are you pregnant? no yeah after the 30 million pregnancy tests that they give you no I am not pregnant but look at all this squish. This is not me. But I just wanted to forewarn everybody. I just hide it with a nice fluffy sweatshirt. Nice cozy sweatshirt. And it eventually goes away. Amos, please be quiet. Um, I don't know why it happens, but like in my boob right now, you can hear like sloshing and gurgling. Um, and as I did research on it, I totally forgot this from like the first boob job I had. But I guess all that fluid drains into your stomach and then I'm guessing you pee it out. I don't know. I didn't really look that much into it. But um, it's just so common. I mean, you guys know what my stomach looks like. And I've barely been eating because... Um, of all the medications, all the muscle relaxers, all the pain meds that they put you on, you just lose your appetite. Um, however, I did have a bagel this morning, so half of that bloat is bagel. And what's going on here? Um, so anyways, yeah, I just wanted to let everyone know that that is totally normal in case anyone else is getting a boob job and is getting this abnormal, huge bloat after um, their surgery. It is normal. You did not gain 15 pounds overnight. Um, it usually takes about two weeks, two weeks to go away. Um, and then you'll be back to normal self and then you'll have these big knockers. So it's totally worth it in the end. And other than that, I am having um, a little bit more pain, like, um, up here. Like, ooh, I can't even feel it. That's, like, numb. Here, I'll show. Keep that right there. Don't move that. I'll show everybody. Phone's ringing. It looks like that right now. This is the bad boob, this is the good boob, or this is the resurgery boob. So they look fairly good other than the stomach bloat. Oh, I'll be right back. Right. Okay, so anyways, that was my doctor on the phone, so. Besides that, yeah, this is just what it's looking like. Um, I mean, they pretty much look the same now, um, other than this big blubber gut down here but this like I was saying is the more swollen one because this is the one that was operated on um, but I mean if you were just looking at them normally they look great so I'm very happy with my surgery um, still in the healing process 
but um, other than that, I'm very happy. And uh, so that was a quick little week update. And um, still not gonna be doing any workout um, because that is just nearly impossible, especially because of the pain. Um, and my doctor will tell me major no-no. I can't even with my kids at this point. Um, but other than that, I'll give you another update in a couple days. And uh, sorry for not wearing makeup because I know it's quite scary. Anyways, see you later. Bye-bye.